North Korea is accusing the U.S. of conducting surveillance flights in violation of its airspace. They warn future similar flights may be shot down. In a statement, a North Korean defense ministry spokesman said provocative military actions by the U.S. were bringing the Korean peninsula closer to a nuclear conflict. The statement cited the recent arrival of a U.S. nuclear submarine near the peninsula. While there was no immediate response from the U.S. military, South Korea's military did respond. They said while the U.S. does conduct routine reconnaissance flights around the peninsula, the North's claim of airspace violation is not true. As tensions between the U.S. and North Korea continue to escalate, North Korean leader Kim Jong-un is recruiting help from an unlikely source, his nation's children. Kim has begun a campaign to indoctrinate the North's young and prepare them to contribute to the country's weapons technology program. At an event marking the anniversary of the founding of North Korea's largest youth group, members gave rocket launchers as gifts to the country's military. The Kim regime is also promoting science, technology and space ambition to kids, with kindergartners starting to learn about computers and robots as part of their curriculum. Kim has also sought to remind children of the danger posed by the U.S. Late last year, he wrote a letter to North Korea's youth, imploring them to, quote, hate the American bastards who want to destroy your homes and steal your hopes. What sets Straight Arrow News apart from the other guys? Well, for one, we're on a mission to serve you, not an agenda. So for factual, trustworthy reporting, head to straightarrownews.com.